Here we go. The game award, and the game award goes to... Here we go, chat. And the game award, the game award. The game award. goes to... And the winner is... And the winner is... And the winner is... Elden Ring. Ten years ago, we began a journey together to celebrate video games as the biggest, most powerful form of entertainment in the world. And How Thursday, are these December awards 12th, right um, nominated and voted on? Is it, is it by the, the people or they have a committee? With the 10th anniversary of the Game Awards. Hey everybody, I'm Jeff Keeley. Welcome to the TGA Global Nomination. A panel of journalists? Today, uh oh. it is my distinct honor to reveal this year's nominees recognizing talented game developers from studios big and small around the world. And you can help select the winners by voting right now at thegameawards.com. All right, you've waited long enough. So let's do Here we it. Go. Here are the nominees for the Game Awards 2024. Here are the nominees. The best ongoing game, the nominees are Destiny 2, BDO. Diablo 4, Final Fantasy BDO. 14, Fortnite, BDO. and Helldivers ah, 2. Ah, fuck this shit. Your best performance nominees are BDO. White for Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth, Hannah Tell for BDO. Life Strange Double Exposure, Umberly Gonzalez for Star Wars Outlaws. Who? Luke Roberts, Silent Hill 2. Damn, this guy is hot. And Melina Yurkins, <gasps> Senua Saga, Hellblade She 2. wins. For the best mobile game, the nominees are... Last Art. Journey, Bellatro, Pokemon Trading Card Game Pocket, Wuthering Waves, Wuthering and Waves! Zenless Zone Zero. Come on, Wuthering Waves! The nominees for best art direction are... Astrobot. Ew. Black Myth Wukong. Oh. Elden Ring Shadow uh, of the Earth Tree. That's gonna win. Metaphor Refantasia. Oh, wait, that's gonna win. And Neva. Wait, for Metaphor might music, win that one. This year's nominees are Astrobot, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, Metaphor Refantasio, Silent Hill 2, Ooh. and Stellar Blade. In the category <laughs> of Best Audio Design, these games are nominated Astrobot. Call of Duty Black Ops 6, Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth, Senua's Saga, Ooh. Hellblade 2, Oh, this is gonna win. Best audio Silent design? Silent Hill 2. Best adaptation. How is this even fair? Hellblade Senua is gonna win that. It's all endeavors. audio. Based on video game worlds. Here are this year's nominees for best adaptation. Arcane, Fallout, Knuckles, Like a Dragon Yakuza, and Tomb Raider, The Legend of Lara Croft. Wait, that has a new game? The, game? the TGA nominees are... Dude, they Final need to slow Fantasy the fuck VII down. Rebirth. Dude, they're going too like fast. Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth, Metaphor Refantasio, Senua's Saga Hellblade 2, and Silent Hill 2. S Hellblade Cinema. Impact, it's all narration. There's no gameplay. Pro-social meaning or message. Here Hellblade Cinema. Nominees. Hellblade Cinema. Closer the distance. Indica. Neva. Life is Strange. Double exposure. Senua's Saga. Hellblade oh my two, God! Sweeping the nominations. Zao. The nominees for best community support are. Baldur's Gate 3. Oh, that wins. Final Fantasy 14. Man, fuck Fortnite, Final Fantasy 14's community. Divers 2 and No Man's Sky. Man, fuck In the No Man's Sky. Best multiplayer. The nominees are Call of Duty Black Ops 6. Oh. Hell Divers 2. Oh. Super Mario Party Jamboree. Tekken 8. And Warhammer 40,000. Who? Space Marine 2. Best independent game celebrates games with a high degree of risk tolerance. As they are produced outside dude, of the he's going too fast, system. dude. I can't conclude. The are Animal Well, Bellatro, Ooh, Lorelei, Animal and Well, Eye, Chad, Neva, and UFO 50. Ooh, Animal Next Well. Is best debut indie game, which recognizes a development team that has won game. a game award. Oh, before. the first descendant. Fact, these teams published their first game in 2024. The nominees are First Descendant, Animal Well, oh. Bellatro, Manor Lords. Pacific Drive and the first is Lucky Squire. For best VR AR game, the nominees are Arizona Sunshine Remake, Best VR Asgard's Game, Wrath 2, Batman Arkham Shadow, Metal Hellsinger VR, and Metro Awakening. For content creator of the year, the nominees Chat, are. Chat, why are you guys correcting Pisa, me? Illawan, Techno Gamers, Aiden Ross, Typical Gamer, 
and Usada Pekora. Who the Part fuck? Of the Game Awards is looking forward to what's <laughs> Just next. And yes, we'll have lots of games to announce on December 12th. But what's the most anticipated Bro, how upcoming is... game? Here are the nominees based on currently announced titles. How are there not other Death content Stranding creators there? On the beach. Ghost of Yote. Grand chat, I know what a Auto fucking 6. indie is, Metroid chat. Prime I don't need you correcting me. And Monster Hunter Wilds. The best action adventure nominees Ooh. are Astrobot, Prince of Persia, The Lost Crown, The First Descendant, Silent Hill 2, Star Wars Outlaws, and The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. For best role playing, the jury selected BDO. Dragon's Dogma 2. Elden Ring Shadow ah, of the Earth Tree, shit. Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth, Like and a Dragon, Metaphor That's gonna win. Metaphor. In the category of Best Fighting, the nominees are Dragon Ball Sparking S Zero. That's a drink. Grand Blue Fantasy vs. Rising, Marvel vs. Capcom Fighting Collection Arcade Classics, Multi vs. and Tekken 8. The nominees for best. Oh my god, he's so going so quick. Black Myth Wukong, Call of Duty Black Ops 6, Helldivers 2, Stellar Blade, and Warhammer 40,000 Space Marine 2. This better not win. Innovation Wukong, please. Celebrates games that are making our industry available and enjoyable to more people. Selected by a special committee of accessibility experts, the nominees for innovation in accessibility are The First Call Descendant, of Duty Black Ops 6. Diablo the, 4, the, Dragon Age, The Veil Guard, the, Prince of Persia, The Lost Crown, and Star Wars Outlaws. Oh, Prince Next of Persia up, accessibility is pretty game. good, chat. The nominees are Best Family Game, Astro Bob, First Descendant, Princess Peach Showtime, Who? Super Mario Party Jamboree, The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom, and The Plucky Squire. Okay, so this category is the basically just for Nintendo games. Are Age of Mythology Retold. Frostpunk 2. Oh. Kunitsugami, Path of the Gods. What did he call me? Manor Lords. And. And. Unicorn Overlord. What the this hell are those titles games? Are nominated for best sports. Sports! F124. Um, EA Sports FC 25. NBA the 2K first 25. Top Spin 2K 25. And. WWE 2K24. Ah. All right, let's take a look at our three esports categories. Starting with uh, restroom break. Best esports. E the nominees are Counter Strike 2, Dota 2, League of Legends, Mobile Legends, Bang Bang, and Valorant. The nominees for best esports athlete are 3 3, Alexi B. Mm, I'm a base off their hotness. Faker. Zywoo and Kong Kong. They're all losers. <laughs> and for the best esports team, our special esports committee nominated these teams Billy Billy Gaming, League of Legends, Gen G, League of Legends, Navi, Counter Strike, T1, League of Legends, and Team Liquid, Dota 2. Team Liquid! All right, it's time for our final two categories. For best game direction, which recognizes outstanding creative vision and Ooh, innovation. No rest game for the wicked. Direction and design. The nominees are No Rest for the Wicked. Astro Bot. Fuck that game. Bellatro. Fuck that game. Black Myth Wukong. Mm, I love that game. Elden China Ring number Shadow one. of the Erd Tree. Eh. Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. And Metaphor Refantasia. <sighs> that game's and gonna sweep this year. TGA Metaphor. Jury which I am not Why a is a DLC is the there? Uh, that's what I'm saying. As nominees for Game of the Year at the Game Awards 2024. The Game of the Year nominees are... Uh-oh, here we go. Astrobot, <laughs> Team Asobi, Bellatro from Local Game Park, of the Year Bellatro? Black Myth Wukong by Game Science. Elden Ring Shadow of the Erd Tree by From Software. Final Fantasy VII Rebirth from Square Enix. And... Metaphor Re Fantasio from Studio Zero. So there you have it. Yeah, Those are okay. your nominees for Game of the Year. That's, yes, that that's so stupid how DLCs are allowed Wormbell. to compete. Later themes live on this very stage on December 12th. But before then, you should head to thegameawards.com. That's just so dumb. By casting your ballot in all categories. Also, stay tuned for the announcement of our Player's Voice category where fans 100% select the winner from 30 nominees. 
We'll announce those nominees on Monday, December 2nd. The winners in all categories will be revealed live during the Game Awards when it streams globally on Thursday, December 12th, starting with the opening. We're gonna need China to rig Eastern, this competition chat. PM Pacific, 12:30. Come on, GMT China, come through. GameAwards.com. Our team cannot wait. Come on, China! It's time. Show. I hope to see you then, and don't forget to cast your vote. Yeah, I don't think China, I know, I know that's why it's going to lose, because ain't nobody going to vote for fucking Black Myth Wukong. It should win, though. Oh, um, is this over? Why did he go so fast, dude? Hey, you. I'm tired of being the hero around here. How about you be the hero for once? Hit the subscription button. Come on, do it. You know you want to.